Hello and welcome to another episode of Cloud Adventures. My name is Chavi and I am an account manager for software companies at AWS. Today, I'm joined by the CFO of WCC, Tone Wonderkamp. Tone, welcome. Thanks, Chavi. So, Tone, today we'll speak about uh, WCC's uh, cloud journey with AWS. Uh, can you first tell us about what WCC does and uh, who you are? Absolutely. Now, at WCC, we work with uh, governments across the world in uh, providing mis mission-critical software applications. Uh, based on our own matching engine, we developed three suites of products. And the first suite is for uh, public employment services, where we use matching to match people to jobs. Second suite is for uh, national security uh, services, where we use matching to identify uh, malicious individuals and allowing countries to decide whether or not they want to have these people enter their country. And thirdly, we work for civil registrars where we, develop, where we are offering an out-of-the-box digital solution for civil registration. Now, the common denominator uh, in these three business lines is that we want to improve the lives of people, eh? whether it's in finding jobs, in keeping society safe, or giving people legal identities. And, and we're doing that already for yeah, more than 100 million people, and we aspire to improve the lives of people, uh, of a billion people every day. So that's our mission. Um, furthermore, now, we've been doing this for more than 25 years now. Uh, we're located out of Utrecht, the Netherlands, and uh, Kuala Lumpur in Malaysia. So, uh, WCC has been in the industry for a long time now. Uh, I would like to hear more about uh, how have your goals evolved over the years and how has uh, AWS helped you achieve those goals? Yeah, uh, so we work a lot with uh, government clients and what you see is that uh, they're typically in the early stages of the transition to cloud. Uh, they all know that they have to move to cloud someday, but they don't know how to do it. And that's where we come in uh, we want to be their trusted advisor in that journey. And working with AWS uh, gives us a lot of uh, yeah, uh, legitimacy in having those discussions. So that's at a strategic level. Then when you look at implementation, uh, also there working with AWS is fantastic. Um, AWS adheres to the highest professional standards in the industry, um, which makes that uh, we, can de uh, we can give our clients the service that they deserve. Um, and we've been working with many partners over the last 25 years and AWS is second to none in that. Um, uh, one example to pick out is a project, an outpost project we recently did for an entity affiliated to the government of Malaysia. Um, we worked for the IT manager, 20 plus year tenure. He said, this is only the second project that I've seen that was delivered in time, scope and budget. Wow. And that is really uh, yeah, due to the good cooperation between WC and AWS. And from high low level design, to actual implementation and getting the recs to the right place at the right time. Um, also, in working with AWS, and we were able to uh, offer this project at a much lower price, and we were able to do it much faster. And we completed it within eight months, uh, whereas with any other vendor, it would have taken at least a year. So, really helped us to uh, to reach our aspirations, so to say. That sounds great. And you know, talking about the partnership. Uh, how, what are the benefits that you've seen in the partnership that you've had with AWS so yeah, far? Yeah, now there's two benefits uh, that I clearly see. One is I see AWS as our window to the world. We understand our industry, we understand our clients, we understand what our clients need. But what AWS adds to the mix is that AWS has an understanding of uh, where technology is going, uh, what other macro trends you see out there. Uh, and bringing that knowledge to us allows us to anticipate uh, and be one step ahead of what we can offer to our clients. So window to the world is, uh, is clear for me. The other thing is I've consistently seen AWS put WC interest ahead of their own interest. Uh, example, um, recently I looked at uh, our cloud uh, cost being a CFO. <laughs> uh, I saw that the housing cost uh, increased quite uh, significantly. Uh, and we had, we had a very good constructive conversation uh, with AWS, with yourself, on Absolutely. how to bring that down. Uh, and in a matter of months, we already reduced uh, the bill by 10% and counting. So that, for me, that's a telltale sign of the fact that AWS takes a long-term interest in my business. Right. This is not about uh, 
how can we make, hey, this is not about the next bill, and this is about how can we make WC successful in the next 10 years, and that is uh, phenomenal for me. Uh, what about next steps? Uh, what, uh, what is on the roadmap for WCC? Next step, uh, enterprise. So we work a lot with governments, very, and we have a lot of experience with governments, uh, and we see that enterprises are struggling with similar uh, questions as governments are struggling with. And then particularly at the, in the area of talent management. Mm. Um, and these are questions like, hey, how do you make sure that people can find a satisfying career in my business? Hey, if I have a vacancy, how can I activate my talent pool? How can, we, how, how can I make sure that the skills of my workforce are fit for the tasks that they need to do tomorrow? Mm -hmm. Those types of questions are relevant. Those types of questions we've helped answer for governments. And we want to bring our experience, our tools, uh, and our understanding also to enterprises to help them solve that. And uh, we will do that also closely in close alignment with AWS and by leveraging uh, programs like SaaS Factory to, uh, to, take us, uh, to take us where we have to go. And uh, we are very excited to uh, surprise the market in 2024 with that. It's exciting times ahead. Exciting times ahead. <laughs> Amazing. Yeah. John, thank you so much for sharing the WCC story with us. Uh, yeah. And uh, our viewers, thank you for watching. If you're curious about how we implemented the Outpost project with WCC, uh, please watch the technical deep dive with my colleague Anastasia.